According to Rabzan Kadyrov, 170 former Wagner mercenaries have joined Ahmad. They have came to Chechnya before, but this time the group turned out to be the most numerous, he noted. Later, the Chechen leader said that the former PMC medical workers had also joined the special forces. Currently, a large group of former PMC Wagner fighters are undergoing an intensive training course as part of the famous Special Forces Ahmad. Tactical shooting courses, field medicine, training of snipers, machine gunners, sappers, artillerymen. This is just a part of the extensive training program. From the Telegram channel Kadyrov95. The transfer of some former Wagner fighters to the Ahmad Special Forces Unit is quite realistic, says Katerina Stepanenko, an analyst at the American Institute of the Study of War. And she admits that this could all be part of Kadyrov's informational campaign. The Institute for the Study of War cannot verify Kadyrov's claims about the number of former Wagner employees who have joined the Ahmad Special Forces. But it's possible that he is trying to use this news to promote recruitment to Ahmad units by showing it is an example. Katerina Stepanenko, an analyst at the Institute for the Study of War, in a commentary to Kafkas Reali. Kadyrov and Prigozhin had many common interests in the past. They have competed for Putin's attention, but they also sometimes teamed up to achieve common goals. For example, together they harshly criticized the leadership of the Ministry of Defense. Later, however, Kadyrov publicly disowned Prigozhin in the several videos spoke out against his so-called march on Moscow. Now, Kadyrov needs the Wagneries for PR purposes. After all, the PMC Wagner was an influential force in Russia. That is why it is important to Kadyrov that the fighters of Prigozhin's PMC should go to him. For a year and a half of the war, they were main and most discussed heroes. By recruiting former Wagner fighters to Ahmad, the Chechen leader is symbolically putting an end to the conflict with Prigozhin demonstrating superiority over his dead brother. From an article by Kavkaz Reali. An analyst links the transfer of mercenaries to the Rosguardia structure to Putin's decision after Prigozhin's mutiny. The Kremlin does not want to put all the former Wagnerites under Shoigu, and this is why most of them were assigned to the Rosguardia. The Wagner was supposed to go to Troshev and supposed to sign a contract with Shoigu, Gerasimov and the Minister of Defense to become a part of the Minister of Defense. They say that this was the same Wagner that was near Bakhmut, but nothing is heard or seen about them. But the same Wagner that went to Kadyrov and Zolotov doesn't sign any contracts with the Ministry of Defense. Analysts at the Institute of the Study of War doubt that the Wagneries will be able to have significant impact on the combat effectiveness of Kadyrov special forces, since individual groups of fighters do not have the same force composition and command structure that was in Prigozhin's PMC. Reported by Anastasia Tarnavska, Victoria Smirnova, UATV News.